All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Girls Frontline, Girls' Frontline, Dolls Frontline. I was just call it, gonna call it Girls Frontline. I think that is the correct term. Um, episode one. Uh, I know very little about this series. All I know is that it's guns. I know the the girls are named after guns. I don't know if they are guns. I don't know if that's just their code names or their actual names. I have no idea. Um, but I know it's obviously based off kind of a game franchise and. That's basically it. That's all I know, which is great because going into the new series, knowing absolutely nothing is fantastic. It's always fun. Um, but yeah, I know obviously it's a quite a popular game franchise, so I'm looking forward to seeing if they've made a good adaption of this. We don't get many good game adaptions, but when we do, we do, you know? Um, but yeah, uh, anyway, guys, as always, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. World War 3? Oh my god. I don't feel like I'm going into this not realising there's like a previous season or something like that I should have watched. Surely just watching it from season 1 is fine. Or th this season, sorry. 2062, okay. So, 17 years after. So they're all like... Robots, or... Not cyborgs. What's the correct term? Okay, so we got M4. We know one of the names so far. I wonder who's the, like which character I'm gonna like more. Let's see. Some terms they use. I'm like, are these guns? Like, that's my <laughs> it's my knowledge of Call of Duty failed me because I I swear some of these are guns. Ooh. This opening's fire. Let's go. Bro, this opening's gorgeous. God damn. So many cool looking character designs in here. I'm so excited to get to meet all these girls. Bro, that opening was fire. Let's go. Super nice art style as well. Alright, so that's AR-15. We've got M4, AR-15. How, like, do they have free will? Like, are they full-on just robots? Or what? Oh, wow. <laughs> 90 Wish Rock. Is this girl a robot? Does she, is she, like, cat girl? What is she? Fox girl? Oh shit, they know they're here. Too old for us to decipher. They really just couldn't get in with a password, that's well. I got straight up and like balls to the wall this series. It's already getting or going, sorry. SOP, SOP2, SOP11. M16, I fucking love that gun. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, is it like a sniper? Hell yeah. <laughs> Seeing anime characters with guns is always so funny. Especially when they're just like cute anime girls. It's like, bruh. The slowest download on planet Earth. What are you downloading? Terabytes. So what, they're contacting now like a rogue unit that's been offline for a while. And they're trying to like draw them towards them to give them, you know, give them orders, I guess. Is M4 supposed to be the captain or something? Get in, Jaeger. <laughs> something about just, like, skim skimpy anime girls just smiling and just spraying you down with guns. Oh, this anime's great so far. Oh, shit. Is she just fighting barehanded? She ain't got a gun? This isn't someone with like a robot body. Is this like the, in the main group? Are they like cyborgs or something? Like part human, part robot? Like what is this? Oh shit! Took her head off. Yeah, they're all good. What have you guys been doing? <laughs> G43. PPSH. Ah, oh, PPSH. What? Oh, good times. 
Oh, it makes sense. Yeah, these being the abandoned teams, they're all like old style guns. Wow. Okay, I get it. Nice. G43, very cool. No, they definitely will not. Where do they keep their ammo? Like, <laughs> presumably their guns are not unlimited. RPG? Oh, shit. Oh, these guys have got, like, future weapons. What the hell? I love, like, the, the German-style guns, the Russian-style guns. So cool. Is this... It's a glove. It's a trap. Oh, there's tons of those agents. Oh, no. Never mind, she has guns. Oh my god. Oh no, battle waifu is getting wiped out. Ugh, another one. Oh god. Don't even give them time to talk, just light them up. God damn. Very interesting choice of, uh, of, uh, of guns here. Just like, upskirt. Mounted guns, yeah. All right, that's creative. <gasps> One of them's missing. <laughs> yeah, well, it's uh, it's not easy. <laughs> we need like an actual sniper on the team. It would sort these guys right out. Oh, so they can't move. They basically can't move when they're firing. That's cool. Bro, how much ammo do they have? Oh my god. Oh, is it grenade launcher? Oh, let's go! Oh! Get fucked. Oh, that was really close. Goddamn. <laughs> we are going to be seeing so many more of these agent bots. Goddamn. It's all part of the mission. Just got to follow orders. Okay? You got this. Oh. Who's this? Gentian. That a gun? I don't know. I don't know it. Okay, here we go. Bro, the ending's a banger. <laughs> yes, both the opening and ending of this anime are so good. This is such a good ending. Fuck yes. Alright, so that was Girls Frontline, Dolls Frontline, Episode 1. Anybody can clarify me, clarify me if I should just be calling it Dolls Frontline or not. Um, but yeah, uh, so very cool first episode. I was actually thoroughly enjoyed with that. Uh, I love the opening and ending for a start. Music was awesome. Um, I do like the main cast of characters. They seem very interesting. And I hope to see like how the anime is going to progress with this. Um, the plot so far is like, it's not you know amazing it's not like spectacular kind of anime plot but uh, it's definitely very cool uh, uh cool action sequences and it's going to be exciting to see where the how the anime does develop and if it can kind of keep my attention on this but uh yeah anyway guys i hope you guys enjoyed this episode i certainly did and i hope you guys enjoyed my reaction thank you guys so much for watching have an interesting day and peace out